Greetings, this is Preacher Dan here to tell you about the biggest Christmas miracle you've never heard of. Open up your Bible to the Gospel of Luke, chapter 1, where we learn about Mary, who conceives the baby Jesus during the reign of King Herod the Great. As you recall, Herod was afraid of the baby Jesus and tried to kill him, but according to prophecy, he failed. Now in chapter 2, we move ahead and we find that Mary and now her husband Joseph have to go from Nazareth to Bethlehem because of a census which has been ordered. And this was ordered by the Roman governor named Quirinius. Now I know what you're thinking. We've heard all this before, Preacher Dan. Why are you telling us all this? But wait. King Herod died in 4 B.C. That's a historical fact that we all know. And after Herod died, his son took over the governorship of the kingdom. And Archelaus was the name, and he ruled Judea for ten long years. But he was not a very good king, so the Romans had to get rid of him and installed a governor of their own whose name was Quirinius, and he took office in 6 AD and immediately ordered a census. So Herod was alive when Jesus was conceived, and we know that Jesus was born when Quirinius was governor at the time of the census, when they went to Bethlehem. Now that's a 10-year pregnancy. Now isn't that a miracle? I think we can all agree it can only be a miracle. Praise the Lord and thank you and good night.